Morning everybody, hope you guys are doing alright. It's freezing cold as hell, it's about 4 to 8 degrees around that and we are in Vienna. Actually Beata, she had the idea to go to this place, we rented a car, it's about what? What time is it? Seven. It's about 7, we're gonna have something to eat and we're gonna go to Hallstatt. It's about 3, three hours 20 minutes drive and uh, yeah, we have to refuel our stomachs because it's gonna be a long way. They actually gave us a smart. Thank God it's the new ones because the old ones, they are very bad to drive. These ones are not that bad. So we finally got to Alstad. it's a village, very very small village, uh, about three hours, three hours and a half from Vienna. That was the time that took us to get here. And this village is so small that I would bet that in three, four, five minutes with a good run you can go from one side to the other side. Yeah. It's very very small, it's a very small village by the lake and everywhere you look you're gonna have an amazing view. There's no way you're gonna look anywhere and you're gonna have a bad view. It's just amazing landscapes. So almost everything here in the city because the city is quite small so it takes like uh, maybe an hour or two to see the whole city now we're gonna go all the way to the top let me see if I can show you there all the way there and to get there we're gonna take this lift which is very very steep should be quite fun and once we get up there we have an amazing view over the whole lake the whole Hallstatt and on the way down we take the toboggans which I can't show you from now, but you'll see it later on. It's, it's, it's gonna be fun. All right, so we made it all the way up. Uh, you take the cable card, funicular, whatever you wanna call it, all the way here, it costs 18 euros. And let me tell you, the view, it's worth every single penny. It's an amazing, amazing view, guys. All right, so I thought the way down, we're gonna take the toboggans to go all the way down, but for you to use the toboggans, uh, you have to take an hour and a half tour through the salt mines, and an hour and a half is not something I wanna do. I'm not very interested on the salt mines, but if you guys are interested to go there, it might be nice for you if you're interested in those kinds of things. So we're not gonna take the toboggan down. I was actually excited to go get some adrenaline on the body, but not happening. All right, so you come all the way up. You have a fountain here and you can still go all the way up until you go until the, the house or a cottage or whatever you call it. And I believe from there you're gonna have an amazing view over this whole thing. I hope I'm not mistaken because I just had lunch, I'm a bit heavy and walking all the way up. Mm, let's do it. next to the houses and uh, the view is nice but it's not what I was expecting I thought it would be a bit higher just have a look see if we were a bit higher we could see over the trees and we could see like the lake down there that would be like awesome but what to do we not always get what we want on landscapes unless <laughs> All 
Alright guys, so that's it. We finish our day here in Alstadt. It's an amazing city. It's very, it's just beautiful. If you have some time and you are in Vienna, you have like three hours to drive here. You're gonna have an amazing day. The whole city, you can see it in around like two hours, maximum three, but you're gonna spend the whole day here so you can actually enjoy your day, take a lot of pictures and everything. And uh, I think that'll be it for today. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and uh, there's one thing. Since the beginning I arrived here, I wanted to do. So uh, I'm gonna give your camera to her. And, uh, and there we go. <laughs> See ya. Oh shit, so good.